the reason that I've been such an advocate for uh, AI safety in advance of sort of anything terrible happening is that I think the consequences of AI going wrong are, are severe. Um, so we have to be proactive rather than reactive. Yeah, if, you, if you take the example of, of say, seatbelts, seatbelts um, were opposed by the auto industry for a very long time, even though the data was very clear that they're safe, uh, that they, they radically improve uh, uh, deaths and injuries. Um, so, you know, we, we don't want to be in that situation where we're fighting regulations, even though, you know, there's a safety thing. I mean, we, we can't wait for millions of people to die in auto accidents. And as, you know, like, and it's important to just elevate the question here. The question is, is, is really one of civilizational risk. So it just, it's, it's not like one group versus another, one group of humans versus another. It's like, hey, this is something that's potentially risky for all humans everywhere.